Welcome back, everybody. I'm Peter Clausy with Investor Intel. In a couple of weeks, it's the world famous mining show, PDAC 2021. I haven't seen a lot of my friends since that show last year. And Barrington, you're one in that group. Barrington Miller from the Canadian Securities Exchange. How are you? I'm doing well, Peter. Uh, thanks for having me. So, uh, mining show is going to be virtual this year. I've been through the platform. It's going to be a little weird. What's the CSE planning? Well, we're planning uh, a couple things. We're going to still have our investor booth, which is the the mainstay uh, as far as the front facing portion for the Canadian Securities Exchange. But we are also designated as a media partner with PDAC. As is Investor Intel. Well done. Uh, ours came about through the Mining Over Canada initiative, which we did in the fall of 2020. Right. It was a six-week odyssey across the country. Um, during that time, we had the privilege and honor. It was, vir- it was a virtual odyssey. You were leaving oh, well, your home. <laughs> yeah, virtual odyssey. Um, but we had the pleasure of, uh, of interviewing Felix Lee, the current president, president. of um, of PDAC. And the response was overwhelming. And I mean, you can not to, not to do a plug, but you can check us, check it out on CSE TV on <laughs> YouTube. Um, I mining, like over, <laughs> mining over Canada. Yeah, yeah. Felix was uh, actually the whole PDAC team in getting that going. So we're, we're doing, uh, we're, we're covering two fronts. We will have our, uh, our media portion, Mm-hmm. And then we'll have our investor portion with the media portion. I believe we'll have um, footage and everything related to mining over Canada, as well as interviews with uh, mining companies or valued mining issuers on the CSE, which are you account doing? for Is it live 100, streaming? 150. Uh, some of it will be live. Some of it will be pre-recorded. Okay. What about in the investor portion? The investor portion, again, we're, we're sort of in the same boat as you. Uh, we'll have our virtual booth set up. Uh, actually, right now we're going through booth duty and booth assignments, uh, which makes it pretty easy. When you have a, a national company, people on the East Coast, they're going to have the morning shift. People on the West Coast, um, they'll have the the evening shift. What a lot of our listeners may or may not know is that even though PDAC runs from March, I think, 3rd to the 8th or 5th to the 9th, First, it start first Sunday of March to the Wednesday. Yeah, um, the the housing platform will be available for I believe three months. So the event will will take place, but then if you missed it, you'll have an opportunity to to uh, to visit. So, so are you proactively reaching out to listed companies to set up interviews, or do they have to contact you? You know what? It's a it's a sweet mixture of both. There's a <laughs> there's a few companies, staple companies that have reached out as soon as January hits. Um, we have our annual, uh, we call it our the, the speed pitch. So it would be at our investor luncheon. Companies will get up there. You have two minutes. After the, you know, one second after, uh, you literally get the hook, and that's either done by Rob Cook. Who okay. will you know start start clapping? Um, we've had a we've had a NHL goal light go off. The <laughs> this year we're doing it a little different. It will be part of a bigger celebration, which I don't want to give too many details away, um, but you'll have to stay tuned. Um, so companies have reached out. They've started in January. There's at least three or four, and I I knew these emails were coming. Like, hey, I want to be second speaking. Hey, I want to be third. I want to be first, uh, which is great. And for the other companies, because we're doing it virtually this year, uh, or because PDAC is doing it virtually, there's more of an opportunity for companies that wouldn't be able to join or travel or, or whatever. To PDAC participate. is expensive. By the time you do uh, the show, your accommodation, the inevitable uh, food, beverages, perhaps, it can be a ten thousand dollar week fairly easily. Oh, oh, for sure. And when we were talking with Felix, he said that they were exploring doing this anyways. Like it's, you know, the time frame just got moved up a little bit um, because obviously of the pandemic. But 
it wasn't completely new or foreign to them. So this is a chance really for the world to see PDAC and for PDAC to get to every corner of the planet because we are doing it virtually. And I'm looking forward to that. The dates are March 7th to the 10th. Oh, March 7th to the 10th. Awesome. Sunday to the Wednesday. What are the odds we can get Rob Cook playing guitar and singing? Because he's pretty good. Uh, Rob is really good. You know, if and we're trying to get him to uh, to post this on YouTube, but he has a uh, he has a pandemic song, uh, which he wrote, which is really really clever. Yeah, um, the, the lockdown yeah. again. <laughs> he sent it to me. Oh, awesome, good. So we're we're trying to get that uh, get that going. I think he might be. Uh, we could coerce him. I good. do believe it. I will buy him a virtual whiskey if he does that. <laughs> Make that too. <laughs> <laughs> Barrington, it's always good to see you. You're one of the faces of the CSC. You do a good job for that organization. Well, thank you, Peter. And thank you for not only your support, but more importantly, your friendship to me and to the Canadian Securities Exchange. Thanks, buddy. You have yourself a good day. Thank you. Peter Clausey signing off from Investor Intel.